and then the probability of having exactly one girl is, wouldn't it be one half two? Okay. As well. All right. And what's your exponent going to be on that first one half? One. Tell me why. Because it's, we're exactly one girl. Okay. And then it's going to be half again. Okay. To the to the third because of the group, right? Or what do you guys think? Do you agree with that? I think it'd be two. Sure. The exponent would be two on the second part. Okay. Explain. Um, because for the probability of failure, it'd be n minus r. And since n is equal to 3 and r is 1, that would be 3 minus 1, which equals 2. What do you think about that? Yeah. So if you have one girl, how many boys do you have to have if the total is 3? Two. Yeah. So that's Sorry. why your exponent's going to be 2 on that second half. Okay?